Right, uh, this is taking off the rear uh, hub of uh, a TR4. Uh, the extension, I've, uh, I've uh, got it partially disassembled to speed everything up, but obviously this uh, comes off the extension with the spline. Then the um, drum. Uh, the uh, problem that I've had with the hub is that the studs, the, the very slight movement on the studs, and that you know they're peened from the back, uh, and once they're loose, it's difficult to tighten them up. Uh, uh, so I'm taking it off. Um, obviously, the uh, this nut split pin out, and the uh, let's get the big spanner right, and this. Uh, is that happens to be a 32 millimeter that takes it that I've got this one so the castellated nut off with the split pin out obviously and uh, you've got your heavy washer on there and that leaves it exposed now to put the puller onto it um, I've got a three-legged puller the problem is you you've got to avoid this is very heavy duty but it, nevertheless you, you can distort it if you exert too much pressure on it and it's a combination of pulling and some shock so the I'll show you what the unit that I've got it's an old American one uh, uh, her brand uh, 82 number 825 H but it's a H for the heavy uh, and as you can see from the ends, you, 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 once you've got the tension, you whack it with a hammer, get some tension on it, and I'll, what I'll do now, I'll mount it on there and um, show you drawing the, the hub off. Now, that's the puller mounted. Um, I don't know if you can see, just it, on the head of this puller, there's a slight pip. And that obviously there's a machining hole in the end for, for when it's been on a lathe. Um, get that central on there. You don't want to um, damage the, the thread on the end of the shaft. But make sure that these legs are dead in line so that you've got a, a really straight pull. And that once that, that is there, sometimes it will come off just with the, the actual pressure of of turning the let's get the tension on this that's starting to pull starting to pull and I've used the, the obviously wheel nuts to, to put onto the end of here that is ready to go now and just by impacting the ends of this, I'll, I'll start that and show you. Now that is under tension and just by impacting the end that's popped it, you can see it's popped out now and the whole thing now will will lift off. Uh, be careful there's a there's a keyway in there, don't lose the keyway and that should just pull off now a bit more bit more tension on that need to keep pulling yeah there she goes that's it up off now that's ready to, ready to be pulled off uh, and I'll show you the putting the new one on